reunion today. It is. Who would have thought? What's that going to be like when 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 Fitz is finally back? Well, I don't know. Does he come back? <laughs> I'm assuming that's going to happen. I hope so. I mean, I don't know. I mean, if it if it did, I would probably Deke would probably be excited. Jeff would be disappointed. <laughs> when he says he doesn't do it, Jelly doesn't we don't film it. <laughs> Like, you just stand there and say the line. On green screen, yeah, the rest of that is just done like that. You don't trust me with the scripts. So. <laughs> so you're the Tom Holland of the cast. Okay, yeah, good, good exactly, to know. Exactly, exactly. <laughs> Did you guys get to watch the episode just now, or had you seen it previously? Yeah, yeah do you know, we went into the... Uh, we went into the Sat the audience, which was really good fun, and, and watched it with them, which was cool. Uh, it was my first time seeing it. It was your first time seeing it, too. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. Well, it's cool to see I enjoyed it, it a lot. I see it on big screen, and it's really fun to see it with um, uh, people in the audience who, you know, have turned through it. And, um, a lot of people in there, you know, are really keen to come along, and they've followed the show a lot since the first which is cool. So it's nice to watch it now. Obviously, been through so many transformations on the show. How are you going to try to do that again at this time? Season six, possibly season seven. Obviously, character comes back. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Uh, yeah. I think the, the 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 great thing about it is it's the the, the show is always um, you know it's a uh, it's kind of unusual for a you know sometimes a two episode network series is you know top people see through every week you know we really the writers do a really amazing job moving the story along and the characters in different unexpected directions which I'm always surprised to be so following in that kind of uh, line of tradition and, you know I'm sure that they, they, they're the ones that they, they really find a way of pushing your internet because they didn't think much about so, you know we are kind of it's clear from the first episode we're in space so, you know, and learning a new language, apparently. Yeah, which is just gold. It's just a bunch of bullshit. Just said in a strong, you know. Nothing in it. But, but, but what was the truth about it was you would, you, would, you know, it was, a bunch, it was a bunch of bullshit, but you would learn how to say that at the same time every time. That's kind of, yeah. How did you, um, how did you prepare to play, like, Fitz's troubles with his trauma? After like after suffering from like hypoxia. Oh yeah. Yeah. Uh, the, we have we, uh, we have like a bunch of advisors on the show, medical professionals and scientists, um, futurists even and things. They are um, very important to that kind of stuff. The writers do most of the work for you, really, and um, and then you just do, you know do your own. Something like that, I suppose it's quite that more than, more than most things it is very important to be uh, respectful to it in the best way you can. Uh, you know, sure, side fight shows are sometimes you get the, the realms of possibility. But, uh, yeah, the, you know, it's just kind of. Uh, like, for instance, in the show, Ian has a girlfriend. Yeah. And that is like. He has a wife. Single my whole life, you know. <laughs> When will that end? <laughs> when will that chapter of my life end? Where do you want to begin? What do you think about stuff, Jeff? How do you prepare? Well, <laughs> I also don't have <laughs> um, No. This is actually just like what Just completely real. Should we just start talking? Uh, no. Um, sorry. The, the preparing, you mean for the, for the actual how science you, of it? Or like yeah, the, just try, how do you, you know, do your research? Or the, yeah, well... You know, it's so cool because um, I, this is my first time being on something for so long that you start to really feel like you've lived a part of this person's life. Um, it, it's a re and, and, and it's also the first time I've ever been a part of something that you're finding out week to week where the story is going, everything else I've ever done, so the whole thing. And so to kind of... Ian was saying earlier, it, it's so, it, it feels like watching the show because each week, you know, like we're left with the same cliffhanger at the end of the table read and like we go to shoot the episode, we have no idea what's coming next. And the writers are pretty mum uh, about, you know, they'll give us hints, but like, so it's, I, it's, I find it really cool um, that you, you know, you kind of just start to, at a certain point, you're living within the timeline 
uh, of this person, and, and they're given curveballs that you don't see coming. And so it's kind of in a really cool way that the preparation at a certain point starts to take care of itself because you know you're just you're just this person in these changing circumstances. What has been your favorite part about Deke's evolution and sort of going from being this unknown to being a part of the team? Um, I it, he goes through a lot, uh, <laughs> and um, it yields some. Um, <laughs> you want to come down to? <laughs> it's really fun. Um, it's uh, no, but it's uh, yeah. It's it's it's. He's got a lot of. Um, I think Deke is someone that kind of responds to whatever is given to him in, in a very. Um, he's a really good survivalist. So no matter what is given to him, he, he's good at sort of zigging and zagging to keep up with it. And uh, he's given he's given sort of an obstacle course that he never thought he'd get with, with that year between last time and now. So it's it's made it's I think it's changed him in unexpected ways, in ways that he never would have seen coming. And it's really fun to play someone who is a version of themselves that they never thought they'd be. So it's yes, I had a blast.